some anodes. Um, what I usually do is I rub my hand on it and if it falls apart, it's not, as, it's not doing its job as best as it could. So it looks like this, this particular service, we're gonna have to replace all the anodes. Um, and there's some visually, there's some anodes up underneath here. Same thing. You can see like where the, uh, where it just falls apart. It's all dusty. It's not clean. So um, that's those. So this particular service, we're gonna have to do the anodes on this. This attracts the corrosion. Whatever corrosion is not gonna attack the engine. It's gonna attack this before it attacks your seals, your paint, your bimetals. But it definitely helps your engine last a lot longer. I always lay it right on the right on the bolt, and then I push it up. I always start it with my hand. Get it on there. Start it. It's on there now. I take the I take the nut out first, and then I take the bolt out. That loosens everything. I'm gonna turn the engines all the way to port to work on, on, on those two anodes down there and these two. And then uh, after I'm done with those, I'll, I'll turn them all the way the other way to get access the other anodes on the brackets. So these are the main anodes. This anode will, these anodes will, uh, um, saves the corrosion from the steering and the trim and tilt so it doesn't attack the seals just a little tap on them and they should come all apart Is that and that teflon grease 24c it's a mercury product there's a little there's a little set dial on it which is nice I'll, I'll turn them all the way the other way to access the other anodes on the brackets. Yeah.